hey what is happening what is going on welcome back to the channel so this is going to be a quick video i actually got a comment on my previous not the previous video the one before that where i showed you how to get your settings so you could get like this and then you could change it to like like that and you could make it that colorful one but um a lot of someone actually asked me how do i render this so you just want to render this if i've got a camera you just want to render it looking like this or if you want to render it not like that then we go back here if you want to render it you know with any of these kind of mid cap mad caps so you want to let's say do it like this how do i render it so i'm going to show you so what you could really do is if you wanted to probably the lazy way or not the lazy way the the long way is if you screen record or you screenshot your your settings and then you just you just screenshot this and you just crop it out you could do that but i'm going to show you how to do it where you render it like an image but instead what you want to do is you want to click on view and go view rendered viewport image and there we go and you can see it's obviously got the lights so let me just take these off so delete the lights and then go back so let's have a look now boom okay now we're gonna have the lights so you can see and then if i change it so if you go to the different matte cap click there let's get the colorful one same thing it'll work exactly the same way so there boom and then what you can do is you just click on image save save it to wherever you want to save it and it saves it as that now let me show you another trick so i'm going to just zoom out with the camera so if i click on my camera and then go to camera and then go here bring this back so let's say i want to render now let's have a look so you see yeah you go here the rendered image it renders it like this so and if you want to change your background you just click here go to viewport then what you can do is you can bring this up you can change the color something like you want and then same thing go view view rendered image there we go so yeah hopefully this helped you you know if you want to do like a before and after it just yeah could come in handy like i said i got a question on the comments on the previous the two previous two videos ago and i just thought i'd make a video and just show you how to do it easy and having to explain it and hopefully it'll help a few more of you guys so yeah hopefully you enjoyed the video make sure you subscribe and check out the patreon check out blender kit link in the description see you in the next video Make sure you subscribe. Don't forget. Peace.